Hi, welcome to update one. I don't know if I can show anywhere in game what it added, but I will put up on the screen right now a picture of everything it added. But basically, I'm currently AFKing for this quest, because in a few quests I get Atomic, which again, as Sid is one of my favorite anime characters, of course Atomic is one of my favorite abilities. But anyways, the first things I should probably do are one, talk about auras. Now, auras are here. Literally, all you have to do is click this little star button and then spin it. You can have the auto roll one if you want. And I'm pretty sure with the auto roll one, you can even close it and it'll keep spinning. Yeah, which is nice. The weekly quests, I think, have been lowered. Yeah, the amount you need has been lowered. I think the amount you need for the previous quest to this one has also been lowered. And also, there's some new codes. The first one is thanks 40k. As you can see, I've already redeemed it. The second one is group 100k also already redeemed. The third one is Discord 50k, also already redeemed that one. And then the fourth and final new code is thanks 30k. Hi, I'm back a lot sooner than I thought I would be. They lowered the requirements for the quest, which means I've completed it now. They also added a new code, which is Auras. Already redeemed, but yeah. While I'm at spawn and my boost isn't here, so I don't have to worry about losing that anymore. First of all, let me reclaim this. Only 20. Oh, okay. I was expecting a lot more, honestly, that's nice. I'm surprised I'm still number 13 on this leaderboard. I have not been training defense. I mean, I was earlier, but you know, then the new quest happened, so I had to train energy for a while, but you know. Also, Sid is not a secret, meaning I just have to wait for him to uh, exist, which is so much nicer. Claim some playtime rewards. There we go. There's also this that I wanna show. I assume anyone who watched the stream or looked in you know, the general chat of the server or whatever saw it, but this was what Kelvin's uh, inventory looked like on the stream. I don't know how many of those are like admin things or tester things or whatever. Speaking of, apparently Gilgamesh is a tester thing, which is dumb. I don't like complaining about things, but when one of my favorite characters is locked behind being a tester, I mean, I'm gonna. I did apply to be a tester. Obviously, I don't know if it'll be accepted, but it would be nice just to be able to help out and stuff and also obviously Gilgamesh. But genuinely, the main thing is it would be cool to test things out early and help out and find bugs and stuff. Speaking of bugs, I thought I was the only one who knew about the durability one, but I did see someone report it. I'm not gonna explain what it is and I'm not gonna show it because why would I? I mean, I'm gonna keep it to myself if I know it. However, if you have eyes, the durability one is pretty easy to figure out. So, but now I just kind of train and wait for Sid to show up on the banner. All right, currently Sid's there. 320,000 gems. Been saving up since Sid was announced. Let's see if it's enough even. I skipped past, but I did get him. I saw him. I saw him there. Where is he? Yeah! Increase health by 35%, universal damage by 10, giving 10% dodge chance. Dude. Strength and weapon? Hell yeah! I do have a strength part of my quest, so that is so good. Alright, I've been saving these up too, so let's hope he gets something good. No matter what, it's not gonna be worse than what he already is, because they only give extra benefits, so. What are we looking for here? I mean, I would assume this one, I guess, but that's a very low percent chance. These are the two new ones. Any of these might be good. I guess we'll see what happens. Meditator 3? I assume that's to do with magic, right? Yeah magic. Avenger? What is that? Strength and weapon. Oh, that is literally perfect for him. Well, now I go back to training energy, I guess. I want to complete these quests because I want I Am Atomic. But yeah, guess I'm back to saving up gems. If Whitebeard comes up or Jotaro comes up or something, I may try to get them. But honestly, that doesn't really matter to me as much. Whitebeard would be probably the most important because I am still on the leaderboard for durability. So I should probably try to get him because he's the best durability champion. But other than that, I'll just wait until they add someone else. If I'm interested in the other character that is. If they add someone I don't really care about, then eh. But you know, I'm just saying like, you know, Kumagawa would be like pretty epic. It should add Kumagawa. Actually, before I forget, I recently got the last boss ability, so I might as well show that off now. In order, all the boss powers are Tsunami, Darkness Sphere, Black Hole, Dark Pull, and that's it, and I have them all now, so I guess I'll show them off. First of all, we have Tsunami. You punch to both sides, and then it summons the waves. There they go. Boom. Second, we have Darkness Sphere. Summons a big sphere. Massive explosion radius as well. And third, we have Domain Exp- I mean, Black Hole. 
You hold it down and it just summons a big black hole void under you. And the final one is dark pull. Literally just a big beam. But yeah, that's everything. Now I'm off to complete all the quests and get the new stuff. I'll make a new video once I have everything to show it all off. But for now, like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. And don't worry, I still plan to do the video where I become God. Don't question what that means, by the way. You'll find out.